Pete, how are you? Good. Good. Good morning. Can you the classroom for a minute? You can. Yeah, we, we apologize for interrupting. <laughs> Too serious. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. How are you today? Everybody good? Yeah. Good. Yeah. 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 There's going to be some visitors coming in here for a very, very special reason. And I'd like your amazing teacher to come over with me a little bit, if I could, please. So let me tell you a little bit about why we're here. Every year, we have a great opportunity uh, to nominate or accept nominations for what we call Celebrate Excellence. And that's an opportunity for our district to recognize an amazing teacher. We have lots of amazing teachers. So we accept nominations from students, parents, and other teachers and other staff. And then we read all of those and we have the very hard job of trying to figure out who we want to recognize as our Celebrate Excellence winner. We had 128 nominations, 128 from parents, and kids, and staff, and it's my honor recognize your amazing teacher, Mr. Tanaka, as Sycamore Celebrate Excellence Award winner. Let's give him a round of applause. So, um, I mean, I, I, I obviously think the world of this man, and I know you too, I can just see that with how you applaud him and what he means to you. But he means so much more to many other people. And he means a lot specifically to the people that have done the nominations. And a few of these great people are right behind me now. So I'd just like to share a little bit about what some of these great people said. So Ethan, where's Ethan? Ethan, can you come up? Now, obviously, Mr. Tanaka um, was your teacher. You're a freshman, right, at Sycamore High School. So you had him in eighth grade? Yes. Eighth grade. So here's just a couple of words that Ethan wrote to us about Mr. Tanaka very helpful and enthusiastic about teaching math. He helped every individual student succeed, and he went out of his way to make sure Ethan felt comfortable, but to make all of you feel comfortable. Isn't that right? Isn't that right? Yeah, I can see your heads nodding. Very nice and caring. We know relationships are important. And this is very, I love this. The only days he missed was when he went on a mission trip to Haiti. I know one thing a lot about Mr. Tanaka. One thing I do know for sure, he does not like to miss work. Here, here. He's here every day. And I know why he does that. Because his passion is making sure he's here for you every single day. And Ethan just said, just in summary, he was my best teacher I ever had. And that says a lot. All right? Okay. So we're not done. He had multiple nominations. So the Yango family is here. John, who actually wrote it, and Dana, back in the back. And uh, the Yangos have had a few kids come through yes. Sycamore Junior High School. So Mr. Yango did an amazing job, and I think this was more specific to Trey, right? And Trey sent one in as well. A absolutely. And, and just some just some comments. You know, Mr. Tanaka's kindness and care for his students go way beyond the classroom. Many of you may know that Mr. Tanaka's a coach, was a coach, and really so his relationship building extended beyond the walls of the classroom. And he not only developed deep relationship with not only students and athletes, but then he followed how they did after they left Sycamore Junior High School. And he'd actually come, even after they were gone from the high school, he'd come and watch them compete um, when he wasn't their coach anymore, which I think is an amazing thing. You know, aside from the math teaching, he'd go out of, out of his way to help anybody, specifically Trey and other students, to help make sure they were successful in math. In math. Um, and, and this is a really pointy comment. Mr. Tanaka works every day to get the most out of every one of his students. He tries really hard to make sure you're successful. Um, he's done National Honor Society. He's been the sponsor for National Honor Society. And that's, that's a high school thing. But I think those students like him to be a sponsor because they know the impact that you've had on them. So, um, you know, in, in Mr. Yango's final comment, I believe an excellent educator award is meant to recognize excellence. He focuses on excellence with the students and demonstrates that excellence is the way he teaches every single day. Okay? So, Mr.
Mr. Messier, I'm grateful that you recognize this amazing teacher. Congratulations. So we had yet another nomination, and this came from uh, Nan Marrow, whose son Nathaniel, eighth grade, right? Now, Mrs. Marrow couldn't be here today, but she um, did a video for you, and Mrs. Neighbor has that that we would like to share with you. Go ahead. Pull it. Oh. Actually, I have to log in, don't I? <laughs> okay, here we go. and Ethan and maybe even Ethan's mom if, they, if they'd like to share something about this amazing amazing teacher. Any comments? I, I mean, I'll just say that um, the, the, the connection will always last. If you like him today, if you don't like him today, you'll forget him. That's fine. But <laughs> if you like him today, you're going to like him until you graduate Sycamore and beyond. Because whether it's at the gym, at, if you go to the Blue Ash Rec Center, he's at the Blue Ash Rec Center, lifting more weight than most of us can do combined. Uh, if he's at the, the high school with watching a game, or if it's just somewhere else out, out and about, you'll see him, and he'll be the same person that you see today out there because he just cares about every one of us, not just you, all of us. And I thank him for that. Absolutely. And I know Trey always said, and I'm sure you feel this way too, <clears throat> he would come into this this class and maybe someone won't get it and Mr. Tanaka can teach it in a different way so by the time you leave this room you're understanding it there's so many times you might leave class like oh, I don't get it and I'm a teacher and I understand that but this guy somehow gets gets through to you guys and teaches you and he's just a great guy. Yeah, and most of you guys won't actually appreciate this right now but he's a really great teacher and in the future you're really going to like him. He's one of the best teachers I've ever had. How about the principal? Yeah. Can we hear from the principal? <laughs> well first of all I, I um, agree with all that has been said about Pete. Um, what is so amazing about Pete is that he is so humble and so down to earth uh, we knew when we were coming up here that you were going to um, hate all of the attention being put on you. <laughs> and it's probably crazy that I'm not teaching me. I got <laughs> right. The longer yeah. this went on. It, it's one thing to be amazing, but it's another thing to be amazing and be humble at the same time. Um, from a leadership lens, your impact on not only the students in the classroom, but on your colleagues. Um, Mr. Tanaka, outside of knowing him as a teacher, is an amazing teacher leader. He helps other teachers in the building informally, and we're very glad that next year he has agreed to uh, be the department supervisor to lead the departments uh, to, to new levels of understanding on how to help uh, not only the children that he teaches, but all of our teachers. So, um, and I consider you a dear friend. So, I'm very proud of you. So, great awards deserves presents. And we have a couple for him. So, we've gotten some things for Mr. Tanaka here. Um, and while you open those, um, so let me talk to you about what happens next. Every district um, in Hamilton County, 22 districts, are doing similar things over the next couple of weeks. And they're identifying 
really a shining star teacher. Um, on May 3rd, um, in the morning, and I believe it's at the Sharonville Convention Center, all of these teachers and members of their family and members of their school teams will come together for a really cool breakfast ceremony where every one of them will get called up onto a really cool stage and have really cool things said about them and lots of people will clap and applaud, okay? So, Mr. Tanaka, you're gonna need to be there and I'm sorry <laughs> that I have to pull, out of, pull you out of class for a half a day. Uh, but we will get you all that information because you absolutely deserve to be recognized not only in front of your students, in front of our school community, but at a county level as well. Because you, in, in my mind, when we think about teaching excellence and the impact of a great teacher on kids, there is none finer than this gentleman. Yeah. So let's give it a Stuff, huh? Great stuff. Yeah. I'll use this to work out. Yeah. <laughs> the envelope, too. Um, okay, and the, the envelope. The envelope, right here. Just wear it right here. Oh, you got that, too. Okay. Yeah, we'll put this down. <laughs> okay. Who who knew I, would, I loved dicks? Somebody did. <laughs> Dr. Just, Ray. This weekend got an FC shirt. So. <laughs> so, <laughs> wow, thank you very much. It's our pleasure. Thank you. So, guys, um, since we've taken 20 minutes of your class time, you all have to come back to school at the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just teaching. I'm just kidding. This was well worth it, though. All right? Take care of your teacher today for me, will you please? All right. Thank you.